Sophia Santisero with us here on the Job and Dola Show, Abington Heights, La Crosse, your in goal. Not easy. How did you like say, okay, start shooting the balls at me, I don't care. Um, so it was like the first practice, like I was in sixth grade, we needed a goalie and um, I don't know, it's just something that I was like, they needed one, it was like, why not? I didn't have to do any running, so it's a plus. Right? <laughs> so. right, there's, there's, I got kids to say, hey, I don't have to run, that's okay, I hear you. Uh, but, you know, you got to take some shots. So is there a point that you're like, okay, I'm not afraid of that. I've seen fast, I've seen fast. Like, or you still once in a while, it's like, okay. Yeah, especially some of all shooters, there's some that still make me close my eyes, but other than that. Let's talk about the defenders in front of you and having confidence in them and feeling good. Like, okay, I'm, yeah, I'm in pretty good shape here. Yeah, I know they always got my back. They're, they're just great. How about winning in the district championship against Crestwood? We'll talk about the, that feeling, the pressure of, okay, hey, can we do this? What do we got to do to win it? Did, were you feeling like, hey, a lot of nerves? There was a lot of nerves. That, um, we all, we, when, as soon as we got up, I, everyone just wanted to, like, the clock to just run out of time so it could just be done and over with. But, like, going down when we had, like, two minutes left, it was, like, really nerve-wracking because, like, we saw the ball and it was yeah, just really nerve-wracking, just hoping that they didn't get the ball back. Let's talk about your coach and your, her ability to motivate you guys, girls, for that matter, I apologize. Um, you know, motivate the ladies and, and, you know, keep things in perspective and just kind of make everybody better. Yeah, she is an amazing coach. She always implements all types of things into practices and always makes us better. Your family, what kind of role do they play in your life as far as, hey, you got to go study or, hey, I got to get you to the uh, lacrosse practice or whatever that is. Tell us about them. They always tell me when I need to go get stuff done. They're always on my butt. Not in a bad way, but they're always there just like making sure I get everything done. Like good parents should, and that's awesome. Let's talk about the, the cheering section for you. Is oh. it is there, do you have some extended family that comes out or friends or is it, you know, do you get the student body out there rooting for you guys? Sometimes you're the student. It's mostly my parents that are always out there supporting us. Sometimes my grandparents will come, but it's mostly my parents. They're always out there. How about your future endeavors? Uh, you still got some time, right? Before yeah. you, you got some decisions to make, but you have an idea right now, hey, maybe it'll be engineering or nursing. You have... um, I'm hoping to go into like social work, so like a social work program and stuff. Very good. Well, congratulations on being a big part of this Abington Heights District Championship, and uh, it's good to hear your story. Thank you.